Addu High School is the only school in Addu city which specializes in studying for Aero. Now Addu High School has around 350 students. In our school, all the classrooms are multimedia classrooms that are equipped with TV and sound systems. We have studied in chemistry that one fossil fuel leads to the emission of greenhouse gases such as carbon dioxide. Greenhouse gases causes global warming. Due to this, polar ice caps melts and sea level rises. Sea level rise will greatly affect lowland countries such as Maldives, which is less than 1.5 meters above the sea level. If we continue using fossil fuels, ultimately we will be responsible for our demise. So we want to do something about it and we want the energy to be produced by using natural resources. country is heavily dependent on fossil fuels to generate its power. In 2013 alone, we spent 48 million dollars on importing fuel. Now, our GDP is 2.2 billion dollars, which means that we are spending 22% of our GDP on fuels. So this means that out of every 5 rupiah we earn, 1 rupiah is being given to the Middle East oil rich countries. Now this is not the saddest part. The saddest part is that such an amount is of money is being spent on something which is directly harming our natural environment, which is one of the most expensive natural resources we have. I'm very grateful that I got to be a part of this project. Through the workshop and project, I learned a lot. Now we have successfully installed 12 barrels in our school, and each one of them read about 235 points. Hi, my name is Patrick Fabian. I'm from Swimsol Company from Austria, and we are right now installing a roof system, a solar system on the roof here at Adu High School.
not show the production, that's important. This will not show the production, only what we don't need and goes to the grid. Okay, so where do we see the production? The production we will see here, at the inverter itself. Yeah. Yeah, okay. And we even can connect it to the internet. After completing this project, now we know that one kilowatt can be bought and installed by spending just $2,500. This may seem like a big amount, but it's not. For a whole city to go solar, we need about $10 million, and our population is about 30,000 people. So, if each one of us contributes around $333, our city can go carbon neutral. And the important thing is that going in solar can be a cause for us today, but in the future, we can earn from it. And this may also seem impossible, but nothing is impossible if we give it a try. We learned that solar panels are not readily available in the Maldives, and there are two parties that provide the panels, but at a very expensive price. Therefore, if we buy the panels from a country like Austria, it will be three times cheaper. High school spends around 100,000 rupiah on the electricity bills every month, and that's a lot of money. Uh, we wish that by using renewable resources of energy such as solar, our school will be able to invest in students' education by giving iPads and e-books to everyone. Making Addu a carbon neutral city may sound like an impossible task. However, after doing this project, we are convinced that it is practically possible. Firstly, we can start with our own school and then our city, then we could go for the whole motives. We want to become future experts and engineers in renewable energy. We want to set an example to the whole nation and to the whole world. We cannot do this alone. We need the support and cooperation in our effort to make a change. It is our dream and we will try our level best to make Addu High School the first carbon neutral school.